In order to consume the REST API from SAC, we need first to create the, um, the OAuth client. And this we can do from the administration and the system, then app integration, and there we can see OAuth client se uh, section and I have the possibility to create a new one. Uh, in our demo, we'll use Postman to consume, and that's why here I'll call it Postman API. Uh, the purpose, I give interactive usage and API access. Uh, for the access, I'll give all possible access for our demo. And it's done, no need to add redirect URL. So, okay, our OAuth client is successfully created. So we can see here that we, we have a client uh, ID and uh, a secret, uh, client secret that we can uh, use uh, to, uh, to consume the API and we will see uh, later in Postman. Okay, let's go now to Postman. And first thing to do is uh, to create a, a new request. I can get the host here uh, of the URL first from SAC. Okay, let me make it a bit smaller. And now uh, I need to add authorizations. And here we choose the OAuth 2.0 and we need to fill the access token URL. And this we can take from the OAuth client's details in SAC. Then for the client ID and secret, if you remember, this we can take from the created OAuth client here. So the client ID, and then I can show the secret. And put it here. Then we need to generate a new access token, complete and this generates the access token and we can use it for our uh, requests. Second uh, thing to, to do is also adding uh, headers. So first header to add is mandatory when using uh, so the REST APIs from SAC and we need to put it to true. Second um, header I'll add is the CSRF token. Since we, uh, for this demo, so we will get the list of um, stories and then I'll uh, update one of the uh, stories uh, we get from the list. So the first, so to be able to update, we need the CSRF token. And for this first get request, I then uh, do a fetch. Then, so I adjust also the URL actually to get the stories. I need to add yeah, the link to the stories. Now I can execute. And here we can see the list of uh, stories that I get. So it was, uh, it, it worked. We have the, the communication working with SAC. So from the list, I can see here the Corgi story. And if I go back to my stories, I can see it here in the list. So what I'll, I'll do now, I try to update the name of this story. So 
I will get the ID add it here so now I'll uh, uh, I'll use the patch method uh, to update it uh, if you remember also for the CSRF token so I need to look in the header response for it if I get the token yes and here it is so I need now to copy it and put it to the patch request and now also I need to put the update and here I'll update the name so name and as a new name I put updated post from postman and now we have everything ready and I can do the update and I can see the status 200 so it was executed and let's check in parallel uh, here in SAC so I reload the page and let's see we can yeah, see that we have it contains now the new name and the uh, uh, update were uh, successfully uh, performed so this is it for this demo. Thank you.